When I heard about the Tortugal Breaker backpack and all the things going for it, I had to check it out for myself and put together the ultimate Tortugal Breaker. And I'm willing to make the claim that this really could be the best backpack for traveling the world's urban jungles, thanks to its size and stealth. The Tortugal Breaker backpack is arguably a top competitor when it comes to travel backpacks for city ramblers. It's not for everyone, but it's indisputably impressive whether it's for you or not. Everyone has different tastes. The world would be pretty dull otherwise, wouldn't it? That goes for backpacks, too. The aim of this Tortuguer review video is to help you figure out whether the Outbreaker will suit you. Let's start with the name. Tortuga is Spanish for tortoise. You get it, right? Tortoises always carry their shells. Backpackers always carry their backpacks easy reference. We've seen people refer to backpackers as snails before, which are definitely not as cool as tortoises. But the name, with the whole tortoise thing, implies comfort, natural fit, and durability. Now that we know little about this backpack and where it came from, let's get into some more detail about the features that make this backpack awesome and some that aren't so awesome. As we mentioned, Tortuga's products are designed by travelers. Built for travelers, every inch of this bag has been thought out. The 35L Tortuga Outbreaker backpack is ideal for people who love traveling light. You can carry this baby onto just about every single airline. From budget to not so budget, this makes traveling extra convenient. It also means that lots of different bags won't weigh you down. In fact, we'd say the bag itself sort of inspires slimline travel. The Outbreaker's clamshell design means it packs like a suitcase but carries like a backpack. This is one of the bag's best and most unique features. Not only can this backpack be opened like a suitcase, but it also has features similar to a rucksack. On the front of the bag, there's an oversized organizational pocket which is just too perfect for neat freaks. There are specific pockets for just about everything you can think of in this compartment pens, notebooks, other paper items, tickets, your passport, and there's even a little hook to hang your keys on. The shoulder straps have pads, and the Tortuga Breaker's chest clip and hip straps add even more comfort. Plus, the back panel is an area premium material, which is great if you're getting sweaty on a hot day. And on that note, like we said earlier, the ventilated backing on the rear of the backpack itself also helps a lot when it comes to comfort. There's tons of ventilation which keeps a sweaty back at bay if you're in a hot country or if you're just a sweaty individual. Even without anything in it, the 35L Tortuga Breaker already weighs 4.6 pounds. It's a bit of a trade-off, because all that extra weight comes from the durable materials it's made out of. It's still light, sure, but for a 35L capacity backpack, the Tortuga Breaker is heavier than usual, and since you'll probably only have the one bag, you'll be packing it to its bursting point. This means it'll be even heavier. The 45L is around $30 more expensive, but you get a lot more room for the extra dollars. Most airlines will probably take it, but make sure you research ahead of time. Some budget airlines even go so far as to weigh your carry on luggage. There are so many different places to stash your stuff in the Tortuga Breaker. From the laptop compartment to the front loading pocket, you have a lot of choices. This is the ideal backpack for someone who loves to stay organized while they travel. It better, given the materials, the Tortuga Breaker won't break under pressure and it's unlikely to rip. It's one of the most durable bags that we've tried. That's because it's sturdy, boasts solid stitching, and it should handle a lot of stress and strain. We are going to end this video right away. If you have any query or information to share, please leave a comment below. Thanks for watching.